So how are you doing? I hope you are enjoying the show. Okay, like I said before, when we went on the break, I said we'll have our guests right there. You have to meet our guests. But before that, let's read a little bit profile about this guest that we have here on the show. So his name is Kevin Kayode Atobiloye. Oh, forgive me. Atobiloye, popularly known as Kevin Power. He is a pro athlete content creator, actor, and you know him as Keith Daniel's personal bouncer. He hails from Ondo and Ekiti State, Nigeria. Kevin started featuring in skits four to five years ago. He featured in Zay Fancy, Sydney Talker, Cute Abiola, Kiki, and Camo skit content. He recently featured in a Netflix movie. So guys, please welcome Kevin Power. Hi Kevin, how are you? Ah, you're welcome. Thank you very much. Sorry, did you find any difficulty coming? It goes as usual. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Kevin. So um, our viewers have been eager to, you know, they've been waiting for you. So can you just do a brief introduction, please? Yes, my name is, uh, like you have said, Kevin Tayodi Atobile. Yeah. I'm from uh, Ikiti. And at the same time, on the town, I like to claim the truth because... Uh -huh. I started so hard from there. From where exactly? On the town. Okay. Just that. So most of my things, my doings and doings is, is from on the town. Mm. So I like to claim on the town. It's my very special place. <laughs> <laughs> that is beautiful. Okay. All right, Kevin. Early? Yes. Now, um, for you guys to um, know that um, we are who we say we are, uh, we have Kevin Parr in the building today. Now, this man is um, um, not just a bodybuilder, but he is also a fashionista. He's also an entrepreneur. Now, I'm going to ask you a question. How did um, bodybuilding start for you? Yes. And how long has it been? What, what created the passion to become who you are now? Yeah, because, pro athletes. Because after this show, um, anywhere I go now, Baba, the guys fear me because, <laughs> yes, I'm, I'm beside Kevin. If you talk to me anyhow, people just know. Kevin is in the building. All right, please give us a bit of <laughs> how this started. Uh, first of all, all power belongs to God. I'd like to give all the glory back to God. Okay. I remember that funny day. I went to see a friend of mine. And uh, the guy likes to do all those backyard benching. Wow. <laughs> and he was doing uh, three, three flywheels. And physically, I was bigger than him. So I felt something like I just jump or uh, carry it like that. So I couldn't lift it. I couldn't lift one. I was looking at this tiny guy, but I was looking at myself. I didn't know it was all about tactics, you know. I couldn't carry one. And he was laughing at me, he was like... And I told him that, look, today I am going, I am going to start gymming. And if I go to school and I come back, you won't be able to come near where I'm training. And that was the determination, and I started like that. Today, I still enjoy what I, what I do. I love my mom so much. Aww. And I, I tried my best to make sure she is the fruit of her labor. May I so rest in peace. Amen. So I was reading law and I thought of it. I look, this woman is getting older. And uh, if I decide to keep up with this law, when is, it, is she going to eat the fruit of her, of her labor? It's so for law to pay. I had to double into bodybuilding, and uh, honestly, there's no regret about it at all. Yes. At all. Yeah. So tell us about your diet. Okay, naturally, are you this huge, or you had to train yourself? No, I wasn't. I was very tiny. But you were tall. Yeah. My okay. My stature, but my determination was too was bigger than me. <laughs> you know, because I, sometimes I go to gym like three times. Sometimes they will have to chase me out of the gym. You know? <laughs> yeah, because what I was chasing was different. Yeah. I like to do my things differently. So, talking about diet, ha. Huh? <laughs> my diet is funny. I eat anytime I like, you know. Oh, okay. If I wake up in the middle of the night, I eat. I don't have any specific time for food. Every single moment for me is food, is feeding. Okay. So, that's how it is. All right. So, tell us about content creating. Like, how, when did you start? Was it before you became Kiss Daniel's personal bouncer, or? Well, tell us about yeah, it. Yeah, I, I started with Sibansi. I remember when we met. Then uh, 
they spoke with me about this uh, hotel creating and I was like, okay, let's try it. And honestly, it's part of the game, but you see, it's that name matter, just drop out like this. Mm. You know, I, like I told someone, I said, I see him as my wife. As your wife? Yeah, what you I meant explain. was, uh, <laughs> you know, you have to protect yeah. somebody you call your wife with every power you have. Hmm. I'm not going to the other side, people think of I'm no, just, no, no, I'm of just course. using it as a kind of example. I somebody I love so much. Hmm. You know, I've been his fans even before I joined him. Oh, okay. You know, and uh, as I joined him, it's been a big determination in me that look, whatever it takes. I don't even care about anybody doing video. I saw that. I, say, I, I was just doing my job. <laughs> that is how I, every job I've been doing, that's how I've always been. Oh, okay. So because I was a Basilius anyway, whichever way you call it. But no kids down there, I've taken him as my responsibility and anywhere we go, I must make sure hmm. I'm answerable to everything. So I don't know how to see it, but I believe I was doing my job. Oh, but well, you worry, you. Yeah, you, you worry, you. <laughs> Don't you worry. <laughs> Let me tell you about the one I don't say, ah, this one, no big, as in, was the day you fling one guy from that stage, fiam, please, what happened to that guy? That I hope guy, he was okay. Naturally, he's a blackmailer. He's, he's, he's do, he, has done, he has done it to Obi Kubana, I think, I think Kubana, oh, chief priest. Okay. I was trying to do picture with him and uh, the guy snubbed. So people started shouting until the guy paid 500k. Yo. So immediately they were group. So when I saw them, I already warned them, please don't come up. To this, uh -huh. don't come up. Yeah. The first one jumped up. I went to him. He jumped down. So I don't know where he got that morale from. I don't know. It's I don't know why you think because you are a fan, you, you yeah. have to create commotion. Hmm. Somebody came with two bodyguards, policemen, and you saw them, and you still want to like dare them. I don't know why we behave like that. Mm. So I don't know how people started talking, but I did what I, I was supposed to do, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You did what I you're didn't know to do. his intention. Exactly. Yeah, people are so dangerous. They don't know they could be dancing, but as we have a chemical. I'm trying to remember the name of the chemical. It's always at the palm. It's all, you, all they need is touch you. Are you serious? Yes. Yeah. So once it touches your body, it goes straight to your heart tree. And that's it. You understand? So people may not understand why bodyguard doesn't want you to come closer to you. Oh. Yes, sir. It's part of the job. Nerve gas as well. So a lot of people you don't know their intentions and you have to do your best to make sure you protect what you got. That's my daily bread though. Hmm. Yes. So, yes, so you have to protect him with all you've got. Everything. Oh boy, I feel you man. <laughs> really? you to do it. Uh, now quickly, um for um people especially um, your area of work and expertise. Um, first, um, she just brought up a topic of how you flung someone off the stage. Mm -hmm. um, rest in peace to the person. Sorry if he's no, not it there. Is no, it is not there. for me. It's my good boy now. Very good boy. <laughs> I was joking. <laughs> now, how do you, as um, Kiss Daniel's security detail, spot danger? You can't spot danger. You have to suspect everybody around you has been a dangerous thing. Mm. That's the only way you can defend. Even the the manager, I call him general. Once it's with him, I suspect him too. Mm. So my job, I always have enemies. If you don't understand the job, you call us bad people. Mm. You can't call anybody evil. You can't call anybody good when you are doing the job. As long as you are there, your basic concentration is on your subject. So everybody around, mm. they are suspects. So you can't spot danger. If you are waiting to spot danger, then danger will have to meet you. Mm. So you spot every corner of your life within, anywhere you go as being dangerous. That's the only way you can defend yourself. All right, good. I want to go personal with you, um, quick one. Now, everybody looks at you when Kevin enters the building. Immediately, you, you spot his aura, his characterization, and personage because he is a big, tall, huge man who can break you like um, spaghetti in two seconds. Now, this personal question is something that I was planning that I, will, I was going to ask you downstairs. That after I ask you, I will run away. 
so that you will not catch me. God I will bless catch me. you. Now, now, personally, when they look at you, some people are tempted um, to fear you normally because of your size. Now, especially the female folk. I want to ask you, Kevin, two questions. <laughs> are you in love? Uh -huh. love why not? I'm so you're, much. You're, you're what, what kind of question is that? I love it too. Yeah. I, there's where I'm going to. Okay. I'm so much in love. So much in love. Oh, yeah. you have someone you're going yeah, out I'm with? A, I'm a teddy bear to someone, man. Fear you does not fear me. <laughs> so, to so see you. See, I, he's, wait, 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 wait. He said he's a. Say it again. A teddy bear to someone, man. They see us. Learn. See. see, see. See, see, all those videos, uh -huh. all those videos you people are seeing, all those people videos you people are seeing that he was doing like this and flinging people. Do you know that in the other room he's a very Calm quiet, down. yeah, of course. Okay, bear. All right. So, Kevin, um, tell us about that particular skate. <laughs> yeah, I was in the gym then. Kamo called me and he was like, "Let's shoot something together," and I like him so much. So. You know when you like someone and you people put energy together, the result is always so good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So how do you um, juggle between being Kiss Daniel's bouncer and your personal jobs? Because I see you're doing a lot of content creating yeah. jobs here. I have so, a boss that I can call him a very good person because he's a person that, that allows anybody around him to to achieve to to your to just to a certain level okay as long as you're doing your job it doesn't stop anyone from going higher mm -hmm. so now and i think that's the greatest passion i have in him you know he never stops me even when he's going out and i have something important to do when i tell him he tells me to go wow so is that is that kind of a good person okay so i'm grateful for him though okay one more question again before um already takes it um I want to ask a question. If do you get other jobs as a bouncer? Yeah, I do. And I, you go? I love my boys to do it. Oh, your boys to do it. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Because I was wondering that how you be his personal bouncer and then still do. And, uh, okay. So do you have like a security company? Yeah, I do. Registered one. Okay. So can you tell us about it? Yeah, Drakel Security Service. Okay. So I, I, I'm already giving our boys, and very soon our e-logs will be ready. Wow. So we're doing it bigly, even both locally and internationally. Mm -hmm. So we're expecting more jobs in this December. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. All right. Okay. All right. So yes, um, in this your line of business and work, um, let me ask you: You've traveled a lot. Man, you're sure. you're still traveling, and you will still travel. Amen. Now, um, two things, two questions. The first one is: What's the farthest country? Um, you've traveled to in this your line of work and um, what's the weirdest food you've ever eaten whilst on that trip oh, that's big <laughs> well, which one is the longest country so australia uh, yeah that's the longest place i've ever been to as a so wow. tired so tiring oh, okay even my boss was tired wow that's so, very far very far so what food did you eat there me and my beloved, they accept any food. As long as you want me to chop up, I go chop up. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. So this is my G challenge because I think a lot of people, this is my G challenge made a lot of people to know you more and you got a lot of fans through this my G challenge. Yeah. How did you feel that at least you took his Daniel's album, this particular song, to another level? Because everybody right now on TikTok, they are doing this challenge, the way you walk, this gorilla walk and all that. How did you feel about it? And well, I feel I'm just enjoying my, the gain of my loyalty, you know. Wow. I'm loyal to him 100% and uh, everything that concerns him, I'm supporting 100%. Mm -hmm. So I think that's just the game. God is just compensating me. Hmm. For being a loyal person to him, so if you are working with someone, you have to be loyal hundred percent, so that God Himself can see you. Okay, well, that's how I see it. Yeah. All right. Do you have any yeah. question? Um, no. I'll, I'll just ask you to please give us your social media handles. Yeah. Official Coffee Power. Are you not on Facebook? I saw something you posted. Yeah, to be loyal, can you do on Facebook? Okay. Uh, X on Instagram, Official Coffee Power. You're not on Twitter. No, I'm not on Twitter, but I'm on um, TikTok. 
same at Obiloye. Okay, so so tell our viewers something. I want to tell the viewers I love you all for always supporting me, for always castigating me because <laughs> when you are not being castigated, you can't correct yourself. Mm. And I want to apologize for how you have seen my some of my services. You might not like them, but I'm sorry. That's just who I am. If I go to work again, I'll still do the same. Mm. Because my job is my life. So thank you all for always supporting me. I love you all. All right. So